Confidence among home builders fell this month for the first time all year. The drop 250 from 56, where reading below 50 indicates poor sales conditions. In the NAHB housing market index was well below expectations and ends a seventh month win streak that saw it reach the highest level since June of 2022. The index now sits at its lowest since May. Driving the deterioration in confidence were rising construction costs, a shortage of workers, and building materials. And last but certainly not least, mortgage rates are now topping 7%. Buffett picked up nearly 6 million shares worth, more than 700 million of DR Holton this past week. Holton is benefiting from robust home sales as high mortgage rates convince existing homeowners to stay tight in their existing home and mortgage. Before we get into the analysis, let's get into this article. And it's coming from the Dallas Morning News. Warren Buffett's firm buys 700 million in DR Holton stock as new home sales soar. So for some reason, Warren Buffett is betting on the housing market picking up. Again, he bought over 700 million worth of DR Houghton this past week or in the spring, according to uh, SEC filings. This comes as DR Houghton, the largest home builder in the U.S., saw a 37% year-over-year increase in sales orders last quarter despite higher mortgage rates and inflationary pressures. New listings on existing home market are low, and some buyers are finding better deals with builders. The Dallas-Fort Worth builders sold a record number of new homes in the spring. Now, Warren Buffett's biggest bag continues to remain Apple and Bank of America. Now, you might not know, but he also owns several private companies. They include... BNFF Railroad, several major utilities, uh, Geico, Precision Cast Parts, Candies, Haltzburg Diamonds, among others, as Berkshire is a conglomerate. All right, so let's go to the charts, and we're going to start with the monthly chart. We have a nice monthly bias level at 108. That zone also happens to line with the all-time, what was the all-time high back in December of 2021. Now we are getting a sell-off for the month of August so far. However, short term, if we go to the daily chart, we can see price is sitting at a short-term support level at the 122. It came in the zone once, twice, a third time, and now we're getting the sell-off. Oh, we had the sell-off yesterday for a fourth time. So don't think that this level is going to hold up much. Thus, I can see price continuing to move down. Now, will it get down to the 110-108 level? I don't know, but that would be the best place to load up and go long as that's where there's a bunch of liquidity just sitting there waiting to get long the stock. How does this look on the weekly chart? Well, price has been in a massive uptrend since last year. So this pullback might just be the pullback before the next impulse move higher. Now, maybe Buffett got in because we might have one more Fed hike in the U.S. later this year. And then the Wall Street is forecasting Fed power cutting rates next year, uh, roughly the June time frame. Um, So again, D.R. Horton was one of three builders that Warren Buffett bought. Again, does he know something that we don't know? Only time will remain to find out. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Please like the video.